Hello, this is Eli from SafeNet Has Technical Support. Uh, I would like to show you some details, uh, maybe elaborate details about uh, our Has runtime or the driver, if we want to call it. Uh, so uh, we have uh, the Has protected application. Uh, let's say it is uh, protected by envelope or the runtime API. If protected by the envelope and data HASP is used, obviously we have a data HASP driver, which work with the enveloped uh, data HASP. Uh, and then uh, either the API or the enveloped application works in front of a license manager. Uh, the license manager obviously is uh, uh, what we have as a service. And this license manager also has a communication uh, via the net network with other license managers uh, and uh, it, it communicates with other license man managers on other machines in order to find maybe licenses, uh, keys, etc. that exist uh, on the same uh, LAN. Now this license manager works uh, with uh, what we call vendor extensions which are specific ones for uh, every vendor uh, and it has also actual drivers which communicate with the hardware key uh, and in addition it has also a specific drivers for the SL for the software uh, key which works uh, with the uh, uh, SL key but we call it a secure storage in the hard disk. Now let's see another view of this. Uh, we see application uh, with API or envelope on one machine and on the other machine the same application with uh, working with API and every uh, machine has its own license manager service and as we can see there is a communication between uh, the license managers and it's each license manager has a USB a stack to communicate with the hardware key, a vendor lib uh, to communicate with the uh, uh, secure storage which is of obviously an SL key uh, resides inside the, between partitions of the hard disk. And now let's see a uh, more elaborate uh, picture of the things. In the application we have uh, API uh, working uh, as a com, .NET, Java, etc. Um, and as a matter of fact this is uh, a wrapper uh, to work with the uh, with the real API which we have the real API is the C API so everyone almost everyone is uh, in that way or another way working with the C API uh, and we see here that every uh, vendor has uh, his own specific API we know that uh, the specific API uh, uh, starts with ASP Windows and underscore instead of a demo which is for the demonstration there is a, a number which represents the vendor ID uh, and then this uh, API works with the license manager the license manager resides under C Windows System 32 it is called ASPLMS.exe and uh, as we know it con communicates with other license managers on other machines and it communicates uh, with driver for the shell and for the SL we have also uh, and this is something uh, new that we are talking about the vendor lib uh, with the format of like as philip underscore and the vendor ID uh, and this DLL as a matter of fact is uh, the communicator uh, in front of the secure storage of the SL key Now talking about uh, license manager, the communication with other machine is done via TCP IP in port 1947 uh, and the names are as following as PLMS on Windows and as PLMD on Mac OS. Uh, this is uh, uh, the license manager which uh, we know uh, to uh, work with it uh, using the ACC is the one that uh, we can configure uh, to communicate or, or not to communicate with other license managers on other machines and have some restrictions who can uh, work with my license machi machine 
which license machines can talk with other license machi machines, etc. Now we're talking about the data hash driver. It's the hard lock uh, sys on 32 uh, bit and AKSDF on 64 bit. When talking about the SL driver, uh, we're talking about the AKS fridge.sys. Uh, we are aware that uh, some from time to time might, there might be some issues with AKS fridge.sys. Uh, however, if you use only HL key, hardware key, uh, you don't need this uh, driver and you can disable it uh, for troubleshooting until something is resolved. Uh, but of course, if you need SL drivers, SL keys, so this AKS fridge is, is a must. This is the one that is working in front of the secure storage. When talking about the vendor extension, we are talking obviously about uh, uh, us Philip with the vendor lib, vendor ID uh, inside. This is uh, this file is uh, being uh, downloaded as part of the master wizard uh, download uh, for from our website, uh, and it resides under C program files, common files, Aladdin Hasp. Um, I would like uh, to make a, sh a small a show to to show you uh, this is the aspelms.exe which is the license manager service uh, resides under C Windows uh, system 32 and we have uh, under C program files common files Aladdin share hasp we have here the vlib uh, obviously for every vendor ID if I have here on my machine two different vendor IDs so I have uh, two uh, different hasp vlib um, in addition to that, we will uh, show it in a minute, but if we are here, we can see also uh, two of the files which re which relates uh, to the uh, runtime API, to the runtime. This is ASPDS Windows DLL, is the runtime API, and this one, ASPDS MSI, is the uh, merge module one, which is used uh, in order to uh, communicate with the runtime API. Uh, in addition, we have here the ASPLM uh, INI, which is the one, uh, we can open it uh, with the editor. Uh, this is the one which is configured by the ACC. Everything you configure in the ACC uh, is, uh, is set over here, and obviously you can do the opposite. You can change here settings, and then in the ACC you will have uh, the settings according to this uh, INI. So let's uh, get back to our presentation and we are talking now about uh, HL drivers. Uh, this is the list of uh, the, AK, uh, the HL drivers, AKS USB, class uh, HSL, these names which uh, we have a list here. On macOS uh, there is another name. Um, and basically uh, this is all I wanted to show you about uh, uh, runtime uh, thank you for watching.